the clearinghouse getting involved. If the customer and the merchant are of the same bank, then this is just a matter of a simple debit credit transaction. So, no cash, cards, checks, or any hardware like POS. So, you can say bye bye to your wallets. And anyone can be a merchant with a single QR code. So, our app consists of three main features the merchant pay, fund transfer, and my QR code. If I want to transfer money to you right now, sir, I would request you to show me your QR code. I will scan that QR code and enter the amount and money is all yours. So if I want to make a payment at a restaurant, I'll scan the QR code, I'll enter the value and I pay. And if I'm at a restaurant with three of my friends, well, who's gonna make that payment? Well, you can split the bill. So the split bill option is also available through direct pay and if you had a really nice time at the restaurant, you could also tip the waiter through our app. So, I'm in a taxi right now, and I tell the driver, I'm gonna pay through direct pay. At the end of the journey, the driver will give me a QR code with all the information integrated in it. So I just have to scan the QR code and make the payment. And if you go online and you want to make the payment, direct pay makes your life so much easier. At the checkout point, you just have to click direct pay, and scan the QR code and the payment is done simply like that. So this is the online payment platform and you just have to scan the QR code and you make the payment. So our payment solution, our payment solution is very simple. So if a transaction is more than 250 rupees, it's going to be only a two, uh, 5 rupee charge. If it's less than 250 rupees, it's only going to be a 2 rupee commission fee. So there's 23.5 billion people in Sri Lanka, out of which 1.2 million use cards to make their payments. That's only 5% of this total population. And there have been 154 billion rupees of transactions just last year. And in Sri Lankan merchants have to pay 4.5 billion rupees out of this as transaction fee. That's 3.3 billion rupees that's paid as commission for the foreign agencies such as Visa Master or Amex. We plan on keeping this money within Sri Lanka and we plan on saving this money. So while I'm talking and telling this to you, there have been 75,000 transactions made on cards per day. One third of it is what we are aiming to gain in the fifth year. With 95% market opportunity and 4.5 million smartphone users in Sri Lanka. In the first year, we aim on beginning 40,000 transactions. In the fifth year, 9 million transactions, aiming on a 19.5 profit. And our market plan is very simple, have strategic discussions with banks and clearing houses. And we, our future is to integrate with Master and uh, Visa to go global. And we also go for international conferences. So, our competitors globally are T-Pay, Masterpass, and WePay. We compete uh, locally with PayApp, Genie, and UPay. And we want to be the local Masterpass and your Visa, simply like that. And this is our team. I'm Avindir Bera, the co-founder, and my two other co-founders, Kanishka Virumund and Dheeraj Kaurantilakar. Thank you, and we are open for questions now.